Isn't it Starscream? Yes, the eradication of entire species. But what do we do about the so-called elements? You leave that to me. With this dark energy flowing through my veins, there is nothing in this universe that can stop me. Not even the Autobots. Yes. You saw out there were Cybertronians, but more specifically, Decepticons. An evil race of robots that I thought I once destroyed. I thought if they came back we'd be well hidden, but Optimus's cameras changed all that. Sorry, my bad. Stupid Optimus! Anyway, the Decepticons traced his camera signal here, and now they want to destroy us all. Our only hope lies within the elements of harmony, elements that you discovered long ago when you became friends. Once again, I must entrust you with these elements, because whatever those Decepticons are planning, it is sure to destroy Ponyville, and all of Equestria as we know it. But why us? Why don't you- I would if I could, but my magic alone cannot destroy the Decepticons. Only you, all of you, can control the elements of harmony. Princess Celestia, you can count on- Hold on a second! Eternal Chaos comes with chocolate rain, you guys! Chocolate rain! Chocolate rain? Don't listen to her, Princess. We'd be honored to use the elements of harmony again. Ooh. You can keep the elements. I'll take that case. Yes, the case is very nice, isn't it? Anyway, take the elements of harmony. Take them now. And good luck. What the? <gasps> The elements! They're gone! This is impossible. It doesn't make any sense. How can anyone infiltrate the castle without setting off any alarms whatsoever? Oh, princess. Becoming more naive than ever. Show yourself! But I'm right here. Hello, Princess Celestia. It's been a long time. Megatron, why am I not surprised? You should be. Your elements can't stop me now, for I have them. We stopped you before. We can stop you again. We... Do not make me laugh, Princess. You and your little band of ponies cannot stop me. Hey! No pony insults the Prince! I'm tired of this arguing. Excuse me, I have a plan to destroy. Twilight Sparkle, you and your friends are the only hope we have left. Thanks, Princess. We won't let you down. Optimus, are you sure about this? Last time we met them, we didn't exactly leave on the best terms. Yes, but I feel it in my spark that this is something we must do. They may not know it, and if they do, they probably won't admit it. But they need our help. We must find out what the Decepticons are after, and we must stop them at any cost. If any Autobot doesn't want to be a part of this, then just say so. Far be it from me for judging you, Optimus. I'm gonna go on ahead. Watch over them. See if they need help. I'll report to you later. Good luck, RC. Optimus, they're just little ponies. What chance do they have against the Decepticons? Have faith, old friend. They may not look it, but they are a strong and proud race. I have seen them through many struggles, many journeys, but like all great creatures, Sometimes they need help, and it will be us that will give it to them. Very good, Arachnid. You keep this up, and I set a promotion in your future. <clears throat> well, it's about time. 
Sorry for the delay, Lord Megatron, but Soundwave was having trouble with his signal. So, what did you and Arachnid call me for? She found them. The ponies, to be precise. They're on their way to find the elements that we stole. Oh, so what? We do them at that castle. That's Day's journey, and we'd already be taking the world by then. That's where they found them last time. And at the base they're going, they'll find them in a few hours. I want you to stop them and take Arachnid with you and do your job. 